so good. We should go to the sheriff or call the FBI. Damn it, Barry, they'll kill her. Although I don't know what to expect, so that might be a mistake. Anything's possible. But I don't want to get grabbed. Oh, I'll just get grabbed. I don't care. Oh, wait. It did oh, see? Okay, it's random. It's random what hole he's going to pop out and choke us on. Spiders! Okay. What do we need to get in here? This room isn't all that important. Can't have too much stuff. Okay, it has a red book. <sighs> Damn. Uh, ooh. Uh. An ink ribbon? What? That wasn't what was on the table. What? Yeah, oh, I'm about to get poisoned. Will you take the red book? Hell yeah, and I will take off too. Oh, that was close. Anything else over here? Nope. Oh. That table is so helping me out right now. Anything else? No. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, pool table. Oh. Uh, I love the new angles. It looks like a clock dial. 958. Some kind of code. So that's the code to get into the door. On the original version, they do not tell you what it is. The pool sticks tell you what the code is. But that's one thing this game made easier. I better not get grabbed. That's right. Alright, let's try out this room. Hmm. Anybody here? Oh yeah, there's plenty of folks here. Well, it's two of them, and all I need is one of these. <clears throat> yeah. That's what I thought. That's what I thought, boys. Mama is here. Nothing unusual. Let's lockpick this. Ah, oh, look at that. They're rewarding me with some shotgun bullets. I humbly accept. Let's see what's in here. Huh, surprised they didn't put enemies in here. Let's check out this bathtub. Filled with muddy water. Uh, come on, come on. Before we get old. No, nothing in here? Oh, man. I feel like I totally got played. Oh, you bastards. Toy with my emotions like that. Ugh. Seriously, how rude. How so rude of them. I'm gonna keep this red book. Well, no, I'll just put it up. Whatever. Seeing as I'm gonna be grabbing tons more ammo and herbage, I'll just put it up. First, I'll fully load my shoddy. Then, I'll put it up. Put the book up. Even though we'll be needing it soon. And, uh, is there any more shells? Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, they don't mix them automatically for you here, I forgot. Alright, let's venture further on into the guardhouse. Don't get grabbed. Oh, damn it, get off me. There's a lot more holes in the floor, too. Aside from the big main three, the, 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 the three main ones, there's like... How much more small ones? At least the ankles are the same. Voices are heard from the other side of the door. It can't be true. I've been told a different story. But it's not necessary for you to destroy stars. What about my family? So everything depends on me, huh? Hmm. That was strange. Who could Barry be talking to? 
Let's investigate. Oh, shoot. We can investigate. Whatever. We can grab up some herbs. Another reason why Jill's mission is infinitely better than Chris's is subtle stuff like that. More story going on. More, more, uh, more engrossing, I would say. And I certainly approve of Jill's scenario. Jill is queen. Well, I wonder what that was about. You know what, maybe I was supposed to, uh, have gotten the key up out of here, and then I could have just went straight up in there. <clears throat> Hurry up! We don't want to get stung. We're allergic, remember, Jill? Oh, oh boy. Oh, I always do that. Oh, I should have pun punched in the code real quick. Now, I think with Jill's scenario, dumping the V-Jolt on the root is totally optional. Whereas... The opportunity to dump the V-Jolt on the root in Chris's scenario is something that is optional, but in the sense that depends on what you tell Rebecca to do. Huh. There's nobody here. Okay. Ah, Plant 42 report. Four days have passed since the accident in the plant at point 42 is growing amazingly fast. It has been affected by T-Virus dif differently than other plants have been and shows unique shape in addition to its size. Looking at the way it behaves, it is now difficult to determine what kind of plant it was originally. There are two ways in which Plant 42 gathers nutrition. First one is through its root that reaches into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went and broke the water tank in the basement. Now the basement is filled with water. It is easily imaginable that, that some chemical elements were blended in the water and promotes the, this, the incredibly fast growth of Plant 42. Another part of Plant 42 from the basement grows through the duct and hangs down like so many bulbs from the ceiling of the first floor. Many vines come out of those bulbs and they are the second resource of its nutrition. Once sensing movement, Plant 42 shoots its vines around the prey and holds it. Then, it starts sucking up blood, using the suckers located in the back of its vines. It also has some intelligence. It, it blocks the door by, by twining its vines around its, it, especially when it, ca it captures prey or is sleeping. Several staff members have already fallen victim to this. May 21st, 1998. Henry Sark. Huh, I hope I don't have to fight that thing. It might be brutal. Let's check this out. More stuff for Jill to unlock. Jill must feel like the ultimate thief right now. More bullets for the shotgun. I'm not complaining. No complaints here. Uh, this is a map. I didn't pick it up or grab it the last time. A sketch. On the last Let's Play, but... We'll grab it now. Alright, and... We'll check out this door right here. Was I even holding up? I wasn't even holding up. What's this? Another key? Oh. But wait a minute. If I have this key... Then that means... See, oh, okay. Okay, I know what to do then. I could totally go and fight the plant right now. But I could go downstairs and dump this... Dump the V-Jolt on the plant to make it easier to kill, which is what I'm gonna do. So, let me go ahead and... See if I can make V-Jolt really fast. Which will be really riveting. Watching me make V-Jolt. It'll probably be the last thing I do. We probably won't get to the actual fight or dumping. A V jolt because we're running out of time. What was the code again? Uh oh. Oh, I got it. Alright, hopefully I have room to do this, and hopefully I can do it in a timely manner. Alright. So let's make this V jolt. Uh.
Jill can mix chemicals. She knows. She knows. She knows what she's doing. Chris does not know how to mix chemicals, so he had to have Rebecca do it. Damn. Huh. I barely have room. Uh, do I really need four bottles to mix this stuff? I don't need four. I could make it happen with three. At least I think I can. Let's see. Yeah, I can make it happen with three. I don't need four. It's just more things I'll have to shove into the item box when it's all said and done. Got the water. Where's number two? Umbrella number two? Where the hell is it? Where the hell is it? What? What, do I have to get all of them before I... What is going on? Why can't I... What the hell? I will so use that. I have plenty of health. F that. Just to save time, I sacrificed three herbs. You guys should be grateful. What? What is going on? Damn. I guess she just can't... That is weird. Then what's the point of going downstairs? Wow. I'm confused. Well, that was totally pointless. Uh... Yeah. Damn. Well, I'm gonna go save, and when I save, I'll go downstairs. I, I can't mix chemicals to kill the plant root, so, um... I guess I gotta fight it at full strength, because when you dump the chemicals on the plant root, it makes it weaker. But I guess I have no choice but to fight it at full strength, which kind of sucks. And, and they let you get the bottles. I don't understand. I don't get it. But whatever. It's time to save and render. And when I get back on it, I will finish up. Put these way over here. Put them like out of my sight because they're so stupid. So dumb. So dumb. Alright, well, that's going to do it for this set. Where's the damn ink ribbon? <sighs> Alright. When I come back, the main point of the next set will be fighting the plant monster. So look forward to that. Because I'm not. Alright. Signing off. Okay! It is time for more evil. Um, yeah, we have to go down to the basement area, I believe. Just to see what's doing down there, because basically I could just go take on the plant right now. Let's get the red book on us so we don't have to come back here. I could go take on the plant right now, but there are still places to be explored, and I want to explore them, so let's go do it. I hope I'm not forgetting anything vital. I got the red bug, yeah, that's all I'll need. As far as ammunition goes, I better not get grabbed. Oh, F you, man, get off me, damn. Oh, oh don't worry, I'm about to take care of you. As far as ammunition goes, I believe the amount of shotgun shells I have is suffice enough to take that thing out. But, maybe not. <laughs> hmm. But, oh, I am gonna get ammo down here for sure, so. I don't need to carry around a whole bunch of crap. So this should work out nicely. I wonder what Barry was talking about earlier when uh, we were listening and we heard his voice in this room. Move these silly little shelves out of the way. I believe I checked that, uh, that bathroom in this room already. Yeah, I checked it already. Come on, Joe. There's a ladder. Let's descend it. Yeah, I wonder what Barry's up to. You know what, I think I'm going to shoot for a, uh, a bad ending. 
you know, the ending where Barry dies. Because I'm pretty sure when people let's play Resident Evil with Jill, I'm pretty sure they try to get the good ending all the time. So let's throw a let's play up on YouTube where the let's player achieves a bad ending. Purposely, mind you. And I think to do that, I have to, when he when he uh, drops the rope, to uh, let us descend in the hole that, that the big snake is going to make when we fight the big snake, I think if we leave and do not wait for him to get another rope, that triggers the whole Barry dying thing. If I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, but either way, I'm going to do everything, you know, opposite of, what I, of, of how I would usually do it. In hopes of triggering those events. Yeah, box pushing, yep. I hate it. Very tedious, very slow, very annoying. I'm surprised Jill's able to move those boxes. You know, I don't want to sound like, you know, like I'm hating on women. Women can be strong too, but not Jill. She's sweet, soft, and womanly. Just how I like them. At least this iteration of Jill. She gets all commando later on in the games in the series. Alright, we got some herbs. Yum yum. She's gonna enjoy eating those. Or smoking them. However they take it. Oh, what's this? Water. I think I think there's an extra little cutscene for Jill. Whereas with Chris when you run down here, you don't get no cutscene. But I think here Jill gets one. Oh, let's go here first. Let's check this out. Even though we can't do anything to the root because this game won't let me mix chemicals for some strange reason. Well, I don't see anything glimmering or shining in here. But, uh, this is a totally useless room. This is the epitome of useless. I can't do anything to the root and there's nothing to collect in here. Absolutely, totally, and completely useless. Oh my gosh. Just wasted my time. Come on, Jill. Pump those legs. Ah, yes, cutscene, yep. Hurry up! <clears throat> oh, wait a minute. <gasps> uh oh. Control room key. I don't have that. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, damn it! No, no, we are not dying to some sharks. Move it. We are not dying on these little punk ass sharks. What is up with that? That is true, I so don't have the control room key. Hmm. Damn. I forgot all about it. Huh. Well, the only other place the control room key could be is in the uh, room that we unlocked earlier with the silver dorm key. I believe it was silver. So that's the only... What kind of damage? Oh my goodness, are you serious? I probably... Oh no, that did the job. Got me all the way back. Can't believe those sharks did that much damage. Well, I guess getting your leg gnawed on would do that at least that much damage to somebody. Have them in orange caution. I know I checked in here. Let's, let's, just, let's just be sure as to not waste any time. I'm certain I checked in here. Yeah, yeah, I did. Well, the only other spot... To get the control room key would have to be in the room we have yet to go in, so. If they don't give me the control room key, then I was never meant to go down here. Like, Jill has no business in the basement area. Which is fine with me. There's less stuff to do. I mean, sheesh, we're not supposed to mess with chemicals, we're not supposed to go in the basement and fool around. What is Jill supposed to do in this director's cut? Maybe that's how Jill's scenario is, period. I don't hear anything. Uh-oh. Yes, I do. Who's in here? Ah, uh, it's you. Take it! Take- oh, oh. Is he dead? 